Hello friends, this video on coordinate geometry part 7 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 6. The question says Q 0, 1 is equidistance from P 5, minus 3 and this is R x, 6. We have to find the value of x that is this is the point Q and the value is 0, 1. There is a point called P and there is a point called R. R is x, 6 and P is 5, minus 3. The question says that PQ is equal to RQ. We have to find the value of x. Also, we have to find the distance qr and pr. qr and pr. This is it. So, let's find the value of x first. So, to find the value of x, we have to find the value of pq and qr. Both are same. So, let's find pq. pq is nothing but distance between p and q. That is this and this. So this will be root of x is 5 here, this is 0 here, so 0 minus 5 square plus y is 1 here, y is minus 3 here, so 1 of minus of minus 3 square. So this becomes root of 5 square plus 4 square. Correct. Now, what is the distance between RQ? Because PQ is equal to RQ. So, we will find RQ. This is Q. This is R. So, Q it is 0 and R is X. X component. So, this becomes 0 minus X square. This is 1. This is 6. It becomes 1 minus 6 square. So this becomes minus x square that is x square plus 1 minus 6 is minus 5 minus 5 square is 25. Correct. The question says PR is equal to RQ. So PR square will be equal to RQ square. So we'll get PR square is equal to RQ square. So PR square is equal to this of whole square that is 5 square plus 4 square. And RQ square is this square, so we have to give square root will get removed. That is x square plus 23. 25 and 5 square cancel. So x square is equal to 16 or x is equal to plus minus 4. That is x is equal to 4 or minus 4. There are two possibilities x is equal to 4 or minus 4. So there are two values of x. One part of the question is solved. Now the question is find the value of this uh, distance QR and PR. So there are two cases actually. Case 1 where x is equal to 4 and case 2 where x is equal to minus 4. Let's take case 1. So case 1 x is equal to 4 then the point is R point is nothing but 4 comma 6. Correct. And uh, P is anyway given 5 comma minus 3 and Q is 0 comma minus 3. So we have to find QR. Let's find QR this in this distance. So QR will be nothing but root of, if you see x is 4, x is 0. So this becomes 4 minus 0 square plus in this case x is 6, this is 1. So this becomes 6 minus 1 square that is root of 4 square that is 16 plus 6 minus 1 5, 5 square that is 25 that is root of 41. That is the value of QR. What is the value of PR? Which is this QR and PR? PR will be root of so you see P and R, these points, this 4, this is 5, 
this is 4 minus 5 square this is 6 this is minus 3 so this is 6 minus of minus 3 square so this becomes root of 4 minus 5 is minus 1 square plus 6 minus minus 3 that is 9 9 square so this is nothing but 1 plus 9 square is 81 that is root of 82 so we have got the value of qr and pr this is my answer for case 1 in case 2 x is equal to minus 4 so we'll have r to be minus 4 comma 6 because r is x comma 6 and p and q will be same that is 5 comma minus 3 and q will be 0 comma 1 correct in this case if you define qr because you define qr and pr qr will be root of q and r in this in this point this is minus 4 this is 0 so it will be minus 4 minus 0 square plus 6 minus 1 square plus 6 minus 1 square that is minus 4 minus 0 that is minus 4 square that is 16 6 minus 1 is 5 5 square 25 and that is root of 41 and let's find uh, rq now sorry let's find pq pr pr so then rp rp is equal to pr so you know on pr in pr we have to take these two points so this is minus 4 this is 5 so it becomes minus 4 minus 5 square plus this is 6 this is minus 3 6 minus minus 3 square correct so this becomes minus 4 minus 5 that is minus 9 square 81 6 minus minus 3 is 6 plus 3 9 9 square is 81 so this becomes 9 root right so if you see this this is the value of pr and qr in second case and this is my answer so x is 4 comma minus 4 and pr and qr are 41 root 41 root 82 in case 1 and root 41 and 92 in case 2 let's take one more example find the relation between x such that x y is equidistant from 3 6 and minus 3 comma 4 so the question says this is point x y and there are two points p6 and minus this is equidistance let uh, let uh, name this point this is point a point b and point c the question says a b is equal to a c and you find the relations so let's find a b a b is nothing but this is x this is 3 so this becomes root of x minus 3 square plus this is y this is 6 y minus 6 square and uh, ac will be equal to if you take ac a and c this is x y this is minus 3 minus 4 this becomes x minus minus 3 square plus y minus 4 square correct and now we have to equate this so if a b is equal to a c so we get root of x minus 3 square plus y minus 6 square root is equal to root of x minus minus 3 becomes x plus 3 square plus y minus 4 square. We'll square both sides now. We'll square both left hand side and RHS. We'll get x minus 3 square plus y minus 6 square is equal to x plus 3 square plus y minus 4 square. Let's break this. This becomes x square plus 9 minus 6 x. This becomes y square plus 36 minus 12 y. This becomes x square plus 9 plus 6 x. This becomes y square plus 16 minus 8 y. Correct? x square cancel, x square cancel, 9 cancel, 9 cancel, y square cancel, y square cancel. So what we get is minus 6x 
this again this becomes minus if you take this side this becomes minus 12x minus 12y and this becomes plus 8y then it becomes minus 4y plus 36 minus 16 that is 20 is equal to 6 or we get 12x plus 4y minus 20 is equal to 0 we can take 4 common at least so this becomes 3x plus y minus 5 is equal to 0 and that is my equation so this is the relation between x and y such that x y point is equidistant from point 3 comma 6 and minus 3 comma 4. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.